Hi, I'm District 32 Director Kyle Hall. I want to continue talking about the theme for this holiday season, which is gratitude, thankfulness. And I want to start by saying I'm very grateful that all the reports from Alaska is that none of our None of our members have been injured or seriously hurt. Uh, you know, a few things thrown around, but but the Alaskan earthquake has not uh, hurt any of our members, at least that I've heard. And if and if you have been hurt, well, let us know. But I'm I'm glad you're all okay, and I'm glad that the uh, hundreds of aftershocks you're experiencing haven't proven to be any more damaging. I'm also grateful. I don't know if you know this, but uh, the end of November is the is the deadline for our area directors to get their area director reports in, and 95% of our area director reports were in on time. That's wonderful. That's amazing. And if you're thinking, yeah, but nobody reads those reports, you're wrong. Every single one of those reports gets read, and most of them get replied to. We either we either reply to the area director with questions, or maybe we reply with suggestions. But every single one of those gets read. Those are useful, critical reports for the district planning our trainings and things like that. I am grateful. We've had four of our six districts have done their member development days, and the feedback we've been getting from people is overwhelmingly positive. People have been saying, this is exactly what I needed. Gee, I want more of this. So I'm really grateful for all of the work people have done to put on these very valuable trainings for our members. Personally, in Toastmasters, I'm grateful for a club that pushes me. What do I mean by that? Well, my club, pushes me to be a better speaker, pushes me to be a better leader, pushes me to try things I haven't done before. I, I value having a club that pushes me just a little bit. And of course, I can't do one of these videos without challenging you. So here's my challenge for you. Does your club push you? If your club doesn't push you, it may be time for you to start pushing your club. What do I mean by that? If your club doesn't push you, you need to encourage your club to get a little better. How do you do that? Well, volunteer to be the general evaluator as often as you can and make sure that you have suggestions for improvement for the various roles in the meeting. And, volunteer, and when you can't be general evaluator, volunteer to be an evaluator and make sure you have suggestions for improvement for the speakers. And if you do that, slowly over time, your club will get better. Your quality of your club will get better. Your meetings will get better. You'll get more members and your club will turn around and start pushing you. That's how it works. So clubs that push us and we push our clubs and that's how we create happy, healthy, vibrant clubs. Happy holidays.